So good morning and welcome back to the vlog. We have checked in to the apartment where we will be staying in the south of Girona here for the next couple of days. If you haven't watched the last video, you'll know that we're here for an ultra endurance event or race, which is taking place uh, this weekend called the Tracker, 360 kilometers of gravel. And my two friends, Tom and Ollie, have just rocked up. So let's go say hello. Hi mate. Hello, how are you? Good, fancy meeting you here. Fancy seeing you here. <laughs> He's made it. He's made it. Hello, mate. You've got me on bike, straddling bike. <laughs> Ready to ride. Ready to go. But it does feel like we're in a like fortress, like a submarine down here. Yes. High security. It's like, it's like 10, 10 buttons to press yeah, to get yeah. out, isn't it? <laughs> where, where does the route to Mark uh, on the weekend go? It goes down towards the coast, is it? So it goes up around this bit down here. Then there's a little bonus bit there. And yeah. Goes around. Oh, there we go. Can't wait. All right. Automatically. So the four of us are out on the road, two of which have just built their bikes. Liam's come to meet us from where he's staying, about 30k away, and we're just going to do a little spin of about 30, 40k out towards where he's staying and then back around again. Beautiful sunshine, going to get tan. What a day we have today, hey? Stunning. The Stunning. sun's come out to welcome you, mate. <laughs> we brought it with us. First time in Girona, right? First time in Girona, I'm liking it. First impressions, yeah? First impressions, good. It might rival Mallorca. Really? Prefer it to Calpe. Yeah, already? Yeah, already. Whoa, already. big claim here, guys. <laughs> Bonk. Made it. <laughs> 20k in your bunk, mate. He needs a Snickers. That bodes well. <laughs> big bonk. Right, that's what happens when you travel, isn't it? Oh, Exhausting. Yeah. It's not looking good, is it? If we're having, <laughs> yeah. having to have a Pepsi bonk stop after a 20k ride. <laughs> Where's the Aquarius, mate? I thought you were getting Aquarius. I didn't have any. They, had a, bit, they had a bit of Naranja, but like what? Um, but no, no Aquarius. Disappointing. Oh, I can run it open. Fanta Ramon and a Pete and a Pear. Guess what I did earlier? What? Oh, mate. No, you didn't. Is that. I think it's just the. Uh, the protector. I think, uh, uh, yeah. What did you do? It's not been verified yet. <laughs> Checking my Bitcoin. So I had 65k in the bank and just <laughs> shocked me. <laughs> How like yeah. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Catch you tomorrow. For our final preparation day. Yeah, last last bits and bobs sort exactly. out. Exactly. <laughs> All right, mate. Nice little spin, how the legs feel? Lovely, they're feeling pretty bad at the moment. But yeah. To be expected after four hours sleep and a day sat on uh, planes and trains, but I feel much better for having a spin. Better tomorrow. Yeah. And it's going to be like the nicest weather tomorrow as well, isn't it? 25 degrees. Good morning and welcome back to the beautiful Rose of Girona. We are once again out on the bikes. Today we've got a really decent group of uh, eight of us, I think, heading over to Bagnoles for a cafe stop. Final prep before the race, which starts in the morning. And after the ride this morning, we've got an afternoon of checking our bike, making sure that it passes all the tests, the briefing, getting our numbers, all the exciting stuff. What's up? Fancy meeting you out here. Where are we going today? Where, where, where's the route? Seeing uh, as you live here, I can ask you that question. The uh, Banyolas loop. Okay. So it's like a 50k loop. Yeah. And there's a nice coffee coffee stop on the lake. Okay. Hello. What's this, mate? The Haribo factory. The Haribo factory? Yeah, if you need some sugar, just stop here. <laughs> Kilos of candy. Okay. Hey, to be fair, if you ever needed candy in your whole life, it probably would be. Good. This is quite good. Probably would be the day before. The one. What are we buying? Yeah, what you buy? I don't know. A few kilos. Been here before. What's what's what do you buy when you're here? Just as much candy as I can fathom. Yeah. Yeah. You don't got anywhere to put it. Back here.
All of it. All of it. About as much as you can carry. Yeah, you must carry it. You must carry it. What are we going for? <laughs> Still not sure. We got straws here. Cherries. Yeah. And cherries and something white. Oh, maybe it's cream. <laughs> <laughs> it's the mascot for the trip. Soft toys. Honestly, we've all got to carry one round. Yeah. Yeah. How? We're gonna have to go full. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there you go. On the get round for tomorrow. Oh yeah, it's arrow, isn't it? As well, the arrow, arrow belly. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Right, so perfect. Two and a half hours on the clock, back to our apartment. Now we've got a whole list of logistical stuff to do to get sorted for the race tomorrow, including a whole lot of faff with these transponders, which give off our location and check that we're not cheating, doing everything correctly, I guess. I guess we want to do all the faff now so that we don't need to do any tomorrow, right? Yeah, the question is, do we do the faff in Dirty Shammies or out of Dirty Shammies? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, can you see uh, some people just kind of go right to the yeah. So on the ride, I must admit, my gears didn't quite feel right. And upon looking at them when we got back, I realised I had a gear cable that was starting to fray, needed to be replaced. So shout out to the guys at Eat Sleep Cycle who squeezed me in last minute was able to sort out the problem, replace gear cable. Now I'm good to go. I'm heading over to sign on now so I can get my numbers and see Liam talk on the panel because he's been invited. There's a, there's a yeah, like, talking like, happening. The, the stage is calling you. Yeah. Yeah. No way I'm gonna have yeah. what, what are they hopefully, hopefully they don't ask me <laughs> any questions that require <laughs> brain power. Yeah. You've got a whole crowd here, mate. No pressure. It should be, should be interesting. This, this might be more difficult than the ride. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Station history. It's time for Anti from Sunto. You have not checked the the track. What are you waiting for tomorrow? Just a big surprise. Hello. Yes. His palms are sweaty. Knees weak. Arms are heavy. <laughs> his vomit on his sweaty already. <laughs> Did you film that? Yeah. <laughs> okay. yeah I got it on film. If you don't for tomorrow, just you make us. <laughs> Some of these riders, so yeah, I'm just looking to first of all have fun and then, uh, yeah, I think being efficient will be play a big part when you're riding su for such a long distance. So, yeah, just hopefully no problems. I've got the best tyres, Hutchinson, so shouldn't have any problems there. Here we go. Oh. There we go, here's the rig. I haven't put the rear bag on, but this is the setup we're going for. Ribble gravel bike with 40 mil tires, Hutchinson. All right, mate. All right. All, all checked in, ready to go. Checked in, mate. Nerves are building. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, are we, are we any more nervous or less nervous after hearing all yeah. of that? I mean, Liam's rap was pretty good. <laughs> that, that made me less nervous. <laughs> yeah, the other guys made me a bit more nervous. I think it's going to be a hard start. Absolutely. But we haven't seen Lachlan yet, so exactly. that was a positive. He's probably gone to bed already, mate. Oh, lovely. Oh, look at this. Oh, good. So numbers, tick. Transponder, tick. Briefing, done. Liam's done his talk. And now we're going to head back into town, grab some pasta, big feed. Tomorrow is an early start. We're waking up about 4.30, I think, for a six o'clock start. Wow, wow. Carbo loading, look at that. Pasta. Pasta. Yeah. Is it an eight? Bang. Yeah, Bang. just what we need, isn't it? So good. So good. <laughs> 